Uh, good morning, I'm with uh, Tracy Meehan at uh, Cadeau Gifts and Home Store with lots of greeting cards as well uh, over in Princess Risborough. Mm -hmm. um, Tracy, welcome back to the High Street. How yes. are you feeling? Excited and pleased. Nice to get out the house and just to get the shop open again and hopefully trading again. Yeah, well, that's good. But it looks very bright in here. And as you say, the weather's great. There yep. are people out here. Yeah. Uh, we've had to wait a few minutes to chat because you've yep. got customers coming in and out. Yeah. So how have you used the time that you've been closed? Yep. Have you still been working on the business? And First sort of three to six weeks when we were on proper lockdown, no, not really. Popped in just to check on it. Second sort of six weeks, decorated, deep cleaned, uh, you know, had a good sort out, reshuffled things. So, yeah, we did use it. I mean, I wouldn't get that time. That's one Otherwise, good thing, yeah. Where, yeah, where I've got all the week to, to decorate. So, so you've yeah. made the most of yeah, it. Yeah, I think we use the time wisely, yeah. And in terms of your protocols for safety, I mean, I've sanitised my hands that yep. have come in upon your request. Yeah. You've got a screen at the till. Yeah. Um, card I've, card only payments? If I can. If but, you can. Yeah, I mean, I do have a lot of elderly people in here. Princess yeah. Whisper is an elderly town. Um, so I am taking cash. Yeah. I'd be a fool not to. I'd be refusing a lot of business if I didn't. But yeah, I am, sure. obviously prompting people to try and pay by card if they yeah. can. Yeah, and you're monitoring the numbers in and out as well. Yes, yeah, sure I mean, I've said six because I have another side to it around there as well. Yes. Um, I think I had five at one point today, so I've said six. Brilliant. Um, and yeah, and I've got I've got various masks down there, so if I need to come and help someone for a substantial amount of time, I'll put a mask on you as can well. Do that safely. Whilst I'm behind the till, the screen is obviously giving me that protection anyway. Well, good for you. You've obviously got it all set up very well. So Time. well done for making the most of the time. <laughs> Thank you. So you've reopened. Where has that left you stock-wise overall? I do have a lot of stock um, because obviously I had Mother's Day, Easter, which didn't really, you know, Mother's Day wasn't too bad. Easter was non-existent. Thank you. Thank you. Lady Thanks out. For have you missed? Have you missed this shop? I have. Yeah. Do you shop <laughs> yes, here regularly? I do. Yes. Yeah. I do definitely. Thank Good. You. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye bye. Um, so I do have a lot of surplus stock at the moment. So that's obviously one of the key things. Yeah. Um, we had the spring fair. Mm -hmm. um, which I put a lot of orders in at, uh, which were coming in in sort of March time. Yeah. So obviously, then we shut. So yeah, I'm hoping to to move some of that on now. And you'll have some ranges that just won't be applicable until next year, I guess. Yeah. And that's the yeah. the downside exactly. to that. Yeah. yeah. On the on the gift side, any particular categories that you you know are going to sell through quite quickly now? Any products that your your customers have said they've been missing getting yeah. hold of? The big range for me is Rendell. Mm -hmm. um, Jelly Cat, they're probably the two that I get asked most for, so I don't normally have a problem moving those things We're on. moving that. Um, but I did take on quite a few new supplies, being new to the industry anyway at the Spring Fair. So I've got all that in a lock-up mm. um, that I need to bring in and start advertising. Just It just fell at such a bad time. Literally, I was receiving them a week or two, the orders before lockdown. Yeah. So I've got a lot to do there, but at the moment, I just need to concentrate on what's in the shop and then gradually bring that in. But you've got a lot to be working with, so exactly, that, exactly. that can work for you, yeah, can't it? Yeah. And on the greeting card side, I mean, you've mm. got a really, really great uh, range of mm -hmm. greeting cards here. Um, have you noticed any changes or trends in card sending during the lockdown period? Well, not really, because obviously I wasn't, wasn't here. So during the lockdown, I couldn't say. Certainly, I opened my doors up this morning and I had two or three customers within the first 10 minutes coming in and buying lots of cards. Oh, so they've got occasions to make up for. Exactly, yeah. Okay. yeah. Um, and I had one lady who came and bought a sixtieth and said that it was going to Spain for her friend and she wanted the, her friend to know it had come from a local shop. So she'd hung on and waited. So that was nice. Lovely. Yeah. Yeah. And, and again, just on the stock side with greeting cards, where, where are you left at the moment? No, fine. Greeting cards, I don't hold, I don't hold too much surplus. What's there is there. And yeah. then I replenish as and when I need to. So uh, cards aren't okay for really. Yeah. Brilliant. Yeah. Okay. Well, good luck to you. Thank Thanks you. for talking to us.